I kind of like this less pretentious approach to creating art rather than being like, oh, I'm this fucking genius with this fucking great idea and this oh, amazing spiritual thing. Rather that than to say, no, I'm gonna let my, my body, my history speak organically for itself. And then I'm gonna look at it afterwards and say, oh, actually, this maybe represents this philosophy, this maybe represents this sexuality, but let the things speak for themselves first and then, and then throw a label on them. like to confuse and to provoke because that's when you put people in a space where they can make their own ideas, where they can make their own creativity, where they can love something, where they can hate something, where they can really feel something and do something about that rather than just giving them a relief from day-to-day uh, -day life. I would say otherwise it's just entertainment. Entertainment isn't art for me. Art has to be something that has a the power to change something, the power to make people rethink, the power to make people question and criticize. Circus is a great tool, and once you have a sharpened tool, then you have the possibility to make something with that tool. But circus isn't the only tool, it just happens to be the tools that we have all sharpened. <laughs>